Greetings program, Stray here with Max Arcade. Man, I thought we'd do a little bit of Star Citizen today, you know. Um, this is one of my absolute all-time favorite games. This game is in its alpha testing stages right now, so nothing is optimized. Now, the studio computer has a heck of a time playing it, but you know what? We're going to play it and uh, today and go do some mining, I figured. So uh, a new aspect of the game. Well new to me that was introduced by one of my friends that i've been playing a lot here with lately so hope you enjoy it sit back relax and uh yeah we're gonna go mining in star citizen all right last time i think i was at port olisar so that is where we are at today in the habitat section yep port olisar boom, boom, boom. Ever since I got taught this cool little mining thing. Of course, people have been doing this in the game, you know, since they first introduced it. But for me, it's new. I've been enjoying it. Let me claim that real quick. Got my new ship called the Prospector that we'll check out today. Excellent. AO2. Here we go. So the Prospector is made by Misc Corporation, and Misc are the same people that make the Freelancer, which was my one of my very first ever uh, ships in this game. Is he O2? I think he said O2. So the cockpit configuration, or out, or I guess uh, outlook design, more or less, has a very Freelancer. You can tell, but it's made by Misc. This is Misc has got this kind of nose shape uh, cockpits on like the Freelancer and of course the, the uh, Prospector. That bad boy right there is the mining laser. This is a mining ship. And of course on either side, on both the starboard and port side, you have your cargo hold for the stuff that you mine. It's got these really cool vertical takeoff and landing engines, VTOL, which is uh, new to me, which I'm still learning how to fly so my f flying isn't the best as it has been in other games but or other, excuse me other videos which reminds me i've been wanting to do a whole bunch of star citizen videos so i should probably get to that real quickly you have a, a toilet access yes that is right you've got a little bathroom right there and a shower action right I mean this is a full-on and then of course you got a your bunk right there pillow and a, you know of course your little terminal and food station and all that stuff right here pretty cool and then of course you have the cockpit I'm really not gonna call this a bridge it's more of a cockpit power up systems get our flight ready And then we'll ask permission to leave. You are clear to launch. And yeah, we don't need to really do anything. I was going to refuel, but no need to refuel. All right, let's go mining. Excellent. And just so you can check it out. All right, there it is from the outside. Let's raise those landing gear. Very cool. And then, of course, let's switch the VTOL VTOL engines, right? Vertical takeoff engines. There we are. Not bad. And now let's go to warp or engage the slipstream. Or the quantum drive, as they call it, right? The quantum drive system enables you to enable the slipstream drive or slipstream.
chat. No need to see chat. You know, and some people when they play this game, they they kind of they cherry pick, you know, looking for the best ore and the best stuff to mine and all that. And heck, I just like to play to have fun. I really can't afford it all, all those, all that kind of luxuries. I usually try to take what I can get, but um, I know some stuff is better than others, so I, I do try to focus on that at least, so it is somewhat more lucrative than it is just a waste of time. And I try to avoid, like, I, I've been flying down to the planet's surface here lately. And I've been trying to, uh, yeah, we're just going to fly over here. Of course, now you have pirates and everything. Yes, pirates are a thing in this game. And when I do mean pirates, I mean actual players in their ships that will come. Their whole love in life is to come find you and blow the hell out of your ship. And, uh, you know, so there you've got, like, you know, no cargo, all your time wasted, no mine or no mineral to sell. So it does get a little, uh, yeah. Thus my ever never ending search for a crew. Not for this ship. This ship, of course, is a one person. It was a one seater. But this ship will help fund all the other things and all the other ships and all the other stuff that I do. Look at the scenery in this place, man. Isn't it beautiful or what? Let's get down there and check it out. Man, this place is beautiful. Hopefully they have some minerals up here for us. Oh, they do. Look at that already. Ladies and gentlemen, our first... Our first snag of the game. Oh look, we're, we're like we're, we're we're next to a couple of them. That's cool. Excellent. That little blue hexagon icon down there is actually a uh, is a mineral. Ah, see and see how it's lighting up yellow for us. We didn't even have to scan. Look how lucky we got. So lucky. All right, titanium and aluminum. I am titanium. Sorry, that song like literally goes through my brain every single time I come up on the mineral. Let's try to cut that bad boy open. So the idea here, right, as you can see on the screen, is I've bumped, I've bumped that bad boy up to full throttle, right? And of course I'm in this little tiny rinky-dink mining ship with a with a standard laser uh, mining laser on it so it's not that tough and not that strong so I gotta really get like right up on this rock see and I'm even getting a, a thing saying this thing is too tough for you to get but I've gotten rocks like this before you can try to get it I might not be able to get it though Mining difficulty, I think. Yeah, see, and I'm trying to upgrade the laser on this thing so I can mine these rocks. But right now I'm having, it is giving me difficulty, ain't it? All right, well, oh, come on. All right, so looks like we're not going to get that rock. That's all right. In a, in a little rinky-dink boat like this, we can't get them all. But there's two rocks. I see two rocks. All right, so let's try to find the second rock. There's the second rock. So we'll just fly over to the second rock and see if we can't get it. Wow, look how close they are to each other. We got lucky. Of course, my friend Pyrophoric, who showed me, of course, introduced me to this game and showed me how to mine. Um, we were finding fields of rocks on this planet to mine. 
All right, let's try to let's get the mining laser out. Let's see what this thing is. Oh gosh, called quantanium. We might not even be able to cut this. So apparently, quantanium, which sounds a lot like quad lithium, uh, is the that's the bad boy. That's like the most expensive, rarest thing in the world. And I don't even think I have a. I don't think those lasers even gonna be powerful enough to make a dent in this rock. Yeah, not even close. But that is why we are out here mining and looking for rocks to mine. Is so we can upgrade this mining laser. Because apparently this quantanium is pretty expensive. Yeah, I'm not even going to come, come close. I'm like, right, look. And when I mean I'm right up on this rock, I mean... I'm in a spaceship. Like, I'm up on it, right? Oh, that's a beautiful rock, though. All right, so not this rock, not today. So, and we just looked at that one. Let's see if there's anything else out there. We were headed this way. Oh, look, there's one over here. How fun. Watch, I'm not going to end up getting anything this run. And so, like, the thumbnail is going to have to be all like, You suck. <laughs> hey, it happens. But for me, part of the fun of playing this game is, is just trying, right? It's just trying to get out here and just trying to make it happen. All right. What is that? Looks like some titanium there. A greasium. A greasium's pretty is a nice thing to give, but once again, don't have the laser power to even make a dent in this thing. I can't believe I couldn't cut that other titanium earlier. That one looked like it was wanting to spike for us. I was like, I would have taken that. Right bracket to dismiss. We do not care. Oh, there we go, there we go, come on. There we go, come on. Open up for me, baby. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to get a new laser. Alright. We are coming across a lot of hard rocks. All right, let's see what's over here. I think it's hilarious that I'm like, let's go mining today. Let's have my first Star Citizen video be a showing y'all mining and I'm not able to mine anything. Oh, look, a couple of them real close to each other. We might get lucky. So far, what I consider lucky is us not getting attacked by anyone. Okay, I'm like just... Quantanium on that one. Whew. And barrel. There's no way. Oh, look, another one. Man, they really, they're really they punishing me right now. Why are they punishing me so much? There's no way. I gotta cut that sucker.
Okay. Have an awesome, a great day. Man, I tell you what. There it is. Got here. Man, Sungsin and Agrisium. I'll tell you what. Oh, no way. Here we go. So now that we finally found a rock that we can mine, the idea is to not get it into the red. Just kind of keep it in that green. And the problem is, is that it tends to spike when it's in that green. So you got to be very careful. Because if it gets into the red, the rock will explode. That's what that red bar means. That red bar means that this rock is... This mineral is highly unstable. But, but, but... And I got it! Look at that! Congratulations! Hashtag Trace Tribbles did not rule the day on this one. Of course, this thing is like... Look how it... Like, I broke it up into the... Like, it's rock form. That's hilarious. So, Tungsten... We don't really want tungsten. We want the agrisium. That's what we want. That's what we're looking for here. And there's agrisium right there. And as you can tell, agrisium is very, very unstable. Now, I don't know if it's un as unstable as quantanium. Because apparently, quantanium is like the stuff from Solo that uh, it will like, you know, you have to make the Kessel run in 12 parsecs if you don't want it to explode in your cargo hold. So, I tend to get quiet when I mine. Might not have been the best thing to be to make a video about, but oh god. But it's a lot of fun if you can pull it off. And look at that. Alright. 
Agrisium, 100%. We want that. Inert materials, we do not want. Agrisium, 91.17, we want that. So apparently, we had to find all of those rocks to not work for us. Those, that's inert material in order for us to find the good stuff. So I would say, well done. This was awesome. All right, tungsten we don't want. We want all the agrisium. Excellent again. Tungsten. Inert material. What is this one? So when you break it up, you break it up into a bunch of little tiny pieces, right? I almost I almost might want that. Look, this thing's about to fall over. We got a lot of tungsten here. But there's one little bit of agrisium right there that I want. And if we get some tungsten in there, that's fine. We'll sell that too. You can even sell the inert material, but it's like, I'll give you two cents a pound on it. So it's really not worth it. Look at that. And it falls. All right. I think nothing is left here but tungsten. Inert materials. Tungsten. 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 Not bad. So we'll just leave this rock. And we will find the next one. This is why I don't... Unless... Because the game is in its alpha testing phase right now, unless the game crashes, which tends to happen quite frequently, unfortunately, because the game is not uh, optimized and it's not stable yet. Um, but for the most part, it's it, you know it is so much fun. I love this game. That's why I try. You know, for the most part, I don't get too uh, frustrated with stuff that's going on like in game. Because like if someone were to come and blow me up. Well, they'd get a crime stat against them if your crime stat gets too high. Okay, that's a gem. So usually the gem icons, I was told, I need to be like on ground, on foot, um, mining. And today we're not mining on foot. Today we we're mining in the Prospector. My new ship, I love it. It's an awesome ship. Um, I have to thank Pyrofork very much for showing me this aspect of the game. Because it is uh, another gem. All right, cool. That's fine. If we had our, if we were out, and we'll, I'll make a video on that. We'll go, we'll go hand mining. But we'll get the uh, prospector here loaded up, right? Yep, those are the gems that we were just looking at. Okay. I think we're going, oh, what's that? Dead ahead. Perfect. Oh, look, we got a couple of things in this area. But then we'll go back to Port All-Star. We'll sell it. Right? More gems. Did I just come this way? Is, this, is that what I did? I just flipped around? Possibly. And that is a... Gem. Yeah, I think I did. I think I flipped around is what happened. Okay. No worries. We'll just shoot off into this this distance for this 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 uh we'll shoot off into this direction all right catch, catch some speed ah look at that beautiful see i knew there was stuff that, i knew there was gold in those mountains What happened to this one? Right, we can see that rock. So I want to make sure. 
Aha, uh -huh. yep, I saw it. And it, oh no, that's way over there. Okay. We'll go to this one. We can see that one. Yeah, there we go. There's a rock. Get the old trusty mining laser out. And look at this. This one's on a cliff. This will be cool. When we break it open, it's going to fall down the cliff. All right. Titanium and gold. Hopefully the mining laser is up to the challenge. Titanium is pretty hard to cut, I will say that. Whoa, 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 whoa. This one might be too tough for us to cut. Alright. No worries. Quantum beacon. I don't know what that's all about, but we're not going to deal with that. Alright, so there was one here, but where was the other one? Not that one. That one's far off. Oh, look at that. There's one right down in the valley. Or in the gorge here. Watch, there's probably gems. Coming across a lot of the. Yeah, oh wow, look at that. A lot of gems. Alright, we'll fly back up. What I really love about this game is how peaceful it is. I mean, yeah, sure, pirates mess with you and stuff. Okay, what happened to the thing that was right there? Alright, well, I guess we'll go to that one. Did someone miss that one? Or is it, was it that one? I guess it was that one. Oh, I feel like I'm missing. Yes, I feel like I just missed that one somehow. Alright, no worries. We got one right here. Oh, look. I can see those. Wait, are those... Am I? Did I just make a circle? I made a circle. Watch. I guarantee you. Those are the... Uh, well, let's go, let's go this way. Oh look, we got two of them here. Hopefully I didn't make a circle and hopefully I've... These are new rocks. Agrisium. Wow, this has got a lot of things in it. It wants to be powerful enough that it's like, you're not, you shall not pass. Oh, I can't wait to get a better mining laser on this thing. Okay. You have a friend like right over here though, right? Yep, you do. We'll see what you're made of. 
copper. Sure, why not? Maybe this will be a little bit easier for us to... A little bit easier egg for us to crack open. A little, a little bit easier shell. We got some tough eggs. Sucker does not want to come open. All right. Well, we might have only been able to crack open one of these eggs today, but I think that was pretty lucrative, though, right? Well, we don't know yet until we get back to the station. All right. So that one. area I just like fly wow we got some in this area okay now we just went to that one There's one. What mysteries do you have for us to behold? Does that work? I don't know if that works. Right. Copper and quartz. So far we haven't been able to crack open copper. It's a weak laser. So, out of the out of the box, Prospector looks pretty good. Um, standard laser, standard mining laser. Uh, definitely, as soon as you have the coin, I would definitely say that you would need to go and upgrade it immediately, right? Um, like this one almost wants to cut, but it just—it's not. It just doesn't have enough power. It doesn't have enough juice, right? Look at that. Cut you. Cut open. Yeah, it's just not enough. Alright. So not this one. Let's go check out this one. But we might have to just call it there. And just see what we get for 37% Agrisium. Oh, that's a big old rock, ain't it? Loranite. Well, we can try it. Hey, I, like I always say, try everything at least once. Wow. Tough rocks out here, for sure. No way. Cut open. Alright. Well, I think we're going to call it there. I'm just going to go ahead and take what I got. And I think we're going to... Uh, see how much we get for it. So... 
let's get those engines up let's shoot for the stars and then let's set up a, a destination destination to Port Olisar as soon as we can set a destination to Port Olisar there we go set route Warping takes a long time. Excellent. Quantum travel complete. Now we need to land. Landing bay. And yes, wherever you go, you always have to ask permission to land. Auto land on. Of course, I've been noticing it takes them a hot second to get the auto land thing going, but that's okay. Oh, look, there it goes. Excellent. We'll get out of the ship. And let's go sell our bounty, huh? All right, let's go find that terminal I showed you earlier. Which I probably could have just ran straight across the hall there, which I probably should have, but that's okay. Here we are. Select location. I'm waiting. Here we go. Come on. There we go. Wow! 21 grand. You can't see it. 21797 for 37% cargo hold on that tiny little ship of Agrisium. And we had 62.39% Agrisium, 1.05% inert material, and 36.55% uh, tungsten. Which, as you can see, tungsten, we still got a little bit for tungsten, 
right? We got a, almost close to two grand for tungsten. We got nothing for the inert materials because, I mean, it's not worth anything. And then, of course, the agrocium was wow, 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 wow. That is what I'm going to go mine in the future. Guys, girls, thank you so much for joining me. I hope to see you in the next video.